Hello and welcome to 4302 South Franklin Road. Uh, this home is located on the southeast side of Indianapolis in Franklin Township. It's on a corner lot on the corner of Lawrence Avenue and Franklin Road. You see we have a nice big lot. Looks like uh, I think the guys are scheduled to come out here for lawn mowing tomorrow. It's definitely due. We do have a two car attached garage. We have a uh, shed out back. I'm not going to, it's raining and a little wet, so we'll try and peek out the back door to kind of get a better view of the shed. But you can see it right there. Um, it's a good sized little pole barn, actually. Um, the house is partially privacy fenced in the rear. Uh, we've had a lot of upgrades uh, over, the, over the years, and most recently we've had uh, kitchen and bathroom upgrades to where we've got new modern appliances and uh, fixtures in our kitchen. So this is, uh, this is one of the entryways to the house. This is actually kind of a, t a den area. I believe that this was probably a garage at one time that was converted, and then they added the two-car garage. But we've got nice wood-finished walls in here. Uh, large windows in the front of the room, so great for uh, natural lighting. We do have carpet in, in this room and carpet in the basement stairs, but uh, that's the only carpet in the home. Now this home is almost 1,400 square feet, three bedrooms, two bathrooms, two car attached garage. So um, back here, we do have our two car garage. As you can see, we have a power overhead door, uh, plenty of space in here. It's our typical size. It actually might even be a little bit longer, about a 500 square foot garage. Usually they're around 400 square feet. Uh, this is going to lead us to our basement. We'll get down there in a minute. But uh, in the very back of this corridor, we do have our three-quarters bathroom. Uh, we have a stand-up shower, linen closet, uh, newer vanity and lights, and uh, um, dressing mirror, as well as our uh, toilet. As I said, a lot of these fixtures have just been upgraded in the last few years. Um, we'll take a look out into the backyard. As you can see, we do have this partially privacy-fenced area. There is the uh, shed that I was telling you about, another privacy fence behind it, uh, but it is not enclosed with the privacy fence. Now on down to our basement, it appears that someone at some point had maybe considered finishing the basement. It's very clean. They've epoxied the floors. They did start framing some walls, but they're not finished. Uh, the ceiling's not finished. Um, as far as amenities down here, we do have a water softener, a electric water heater, gas furnace, uh, you can see that you know we've got some framing that was started here, uh, but uh, has not been completed. Nice epoxy floors, very clean basement. Great for uh, maybe a recreational area, something where you can put a ping pong table or a pool table down here, um, as well as extra storage. A couple of sump pumps that have been installed to ensure that there's no flooding in the basement. Uh, so yeah, definitely a nice little addition to this home. Uh, we do have a three bedroom, two bath, almost 1,400 square feet. I think I may have already said that. And uh, we'll get into the common and private areas of the home. So most of the rest of the home is hardwood and ceramic tile. This is our kitchen area. And uh, so you can see we've got newer countertops in here, um, updated cabinets. We have an electro electric glass top stove overhead microwave. We do have a garbage disposal, dishwasher, and a really nice, uh, I believe that's a French door uh, refrigerator, one of the double opening doors and the pull-out ice chest. Lots of cabinet space both above and below on our long wall here and uh, on our wall next to our uh, and around our stove and microwave. This sliding door, pocket door, actually leads into one of the bedrooms. We'll look at it from the other side. Now when we get into our traditional living room, you can see we do have hardwood floors here. Very nice uh, addition to the home. Now this home also has wood blinds in the living room. Nice overhead ceiling fan. So a lot of nice uh, additions that they've done with this house. It's been very well taken care of. Further on down the line, we come into our hallway. Um, this is probably a curtain closet, I think. Yes. So actually it's a pretty deep coat closet. So good little storage area. And then this should be our linen closet with our shelves for linens. So on the right down the hallway, we can see that we have a nice uh, bathtub uh, and with overhead shower. 
Um, once again, we have updated faucets, sinks, uh, even fixtures as our towel bar, and vanity, everything's matching. Uh, very nice work with the, uh, the upgrades that they've done here. And our little cubby with our toilet. Um, I really like these, uh, these tile shower surrounds in homes like this, and, and of course the nice overhead raining shower head. Immediately across from here, we do come into one of our secondary bedrooms. This bedroom also has the wood finished walls like we have in our den. Uh, we've got vertical blinds over the uh, bedroom windows. And we do have a double sliding reach in closet here. So it's actually a fairly wide closet. It's about a foot wider on each side than the door. So it's probably right around seven feet wide. Um, quite a bit of space. Uh, the other bedroom in the back of the house will be more of the master. It's a little bit larger uh, than the other two. Uh, this is probably about 10 by, maybe 10 by 15. So we're at 150, 175 square feet. And then we have another double reach in closet. So all the bedrooms are hardwood as well as the hallway and living room. Our kitchen and our bathroom are both ceramic tile. So this is our third bedroom. We have the uh, vertical blinds in here as well. And this room is uh, about 12 by 12, probably about a little under 150 square feet and a double reach in closet as well. So once again, we are at 4302 South Franklin Road in Franklin Township on the southeast side of Indianapolis, Indiana, where we have a three bedroom, two bath home with basement, two car attached garage, shed, hardwood floors, ceramic tile, uh, updated kitchen, and a variety of updated fixtures throughout the home. If this is the kind of home that you're looking for, then I would encourage you to contact our leasing department at 317-484-8444, extension one. They can answer any questions that you might have, as well as schedule a time for you to visit and view the property in person yourself. You can also get more information on our website at www.rpmindymetro.com, where you can find a complete list of our currently available homes, as well as more video walkthroughs. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video, and we look forward to helping you find your next place to live.